Good evening, everybody. Uh, Baldwin Barnes again with you, uh, Pastor's Corner. I'd like to share with you today something I guess I would call the magic of believing. The magic of believing. The story is in Mark chapter 9. Uh, Jesus and uh, three of his disciples are up on a high mountain and uh, it's the story of the transfiguration, which I'm not going to go into right now, but Jesus comes down off the mountain and he founds a whole crowd around the rest of his disciples. And uh, he wants to know what's going on. And one person speaks up and says that, I brought my son to your disciples for them to cast out an evil spirit out of my son, but they could not. And uh, Jesus says, wow, what's what's happening here nobody has any faith it seems um, bring the bring the boy and uh, of course Jesus cast out the spirit but the the story is really about the interaction between the father of the boy who was healed and uh, Jesus um, it sounds as if the father was questioning whether or not Jesus had the power to cast out the evil spirit because uh, he said, if you can do anything, you know, if you can do anything, please help us. Please do something for us. And Jesus says, if I can do anything, do you know, uh, all things are possible to, to those that believe. So we're talking about the magic of believing. And I'd like to read a little quote for you from the book Desire of Ages written by Ellen White. On uh, page 429, she writes, It is faith that connects us with heaven and brings us strength for coping with the powers of darkness. In Christ, God has provided means for subduing every sinful trait and resisting every temptation, however strong. She goes on to say, Look not to self, but to Christ. Faith comes by the word of God. Then grasp his promise. Him that cometh to me I will in no wise cast out. John 6 verse 37. Cast yourself at his feet with the cry, Lord, I believe. Help thou mine unbelief. Mark 9 verse 24. You can never perish while you do this. Never. Did you get that? The magic of believing is that if you accept Christ as Savior and you listen to his word by faith in Christ, you can never perish if you cast yourself at his feet and you say, Lord, help thou my unbelief. Give me a little faith as he has already given you and you can make it. So let's make it this week and the weeks to come by having just a little faith, believing in Jesus can work wonders for you. God bless. Bye-bye.